there's a lot that we can see from here very quickly. Gaza's just over there. A few miles away, you can see the smoke rising. We're seeing multiple impacts over there in Gaza. But I'm going to ask John to spin the camera around now on these vehicles uh, here. There's a situation about to develop here. Now, the people here pulling, pulling the bags from the vehicles are volunteers getting the identification documents of all those young party goers who were, who were at the party. They were, they were, this is where they were shot up. All these vehicles were shot up. The soldiers here uh, come over to make sure that these people have authority to do what they're doing, literally smashing the windows here. I mean, this is unfolding ar around us here right now. But these people, they, no, it's okay. It's, it's okay. not okay. It's okay. 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 not okay. 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 Not okay. okay. We're, no, we're it's explaining. Not okay. We're explaining. Okay. No, thank don't you. talk to me like this. No, you, see, you can see the man like this. What is it? They're, they're collecting the documents. It's okay. Thank you. It's not about we, collecting. No. Why yeah. move the window? What's the reason? The, well, this is up to him, not me. I'm, I'm not involved in that. So this is an unfolding situation as, as we talked about there. Passions, as you can see, are really high and and with really good reason because this is where those young people had parked their vehicles for that party on friday night saturday morning and this is where they rushed back to when hamas raced in here to start killing them and this is where they were shot up and you can see car after car after car after car here we see their bags being taken out, but we've seen documents lying at the side of the road. It's confusing and active situation. There are soldiers here. There are angry and upset civilians. There are volunteers taking the documents away. But look up here, more and more of these vehicles. And it just really gives you that sense and understanding of, of, of the horror, the horror of the moment when in the early hours of the morning, suddenly the partygoers found themselves being attacked by Hamas, brutally murdering them. We've listened to testimony of doctors who've treated some of the wounded and the and the dying, and they were trying to escape. They were trying to get a, they were trying to get away. It's hard to it's hard to overstate the, the, the horror of what was happening here but you only have to look at the way the vehicles are parked the way that you can see people are trying to throw themselves in to drive away here in desperation and just cut down and the, and the situation unfolds further down the road here more shot up and destroyed vehicles as more of the party goes were trying to leave but i can tell you the situation here is very dynamic it's very fluid it is changing as we've been driving in here just to get to this spot we pass an area where hamas fighters Terrorists were shot and killed by Israeli defense forces. Their vehicles are lying at the side of the road. Their bodies are still lying at the side of the road. And we've also seen the biggest deployment that we've witnessed so far of Israeli military defense forces with tanks, howitzers, armored personnel carriers deployed out in the field, dozens and dozens of them. That's the biggest deployment that we've seen so far. And while we were driving down here, We've seen a lot more uh, reinforcements on their way. So this is an area that's getting, that's having increasingly more and more troops put in here, very close to Gaza, as we're talking about over here. Uh, and again, that's the impact of, of airstrikes there on, on, on Gaza. And they're ongoing. We hear the fighter jets in the skies above us. And then you'll see a plume of smoke rise up from over there. And the reason that these people are rushing in to take away the possessions of all those who were, 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 were killed, injured during the, during the Hamash killing spree. They're rushing in and they're doing this at high speed because they're very concerned about the security situation here. And what they're trying to do is to bring information and relief to some of those families who have no knowledge of what happened to their loved ones. But you've just witnessed what it's like here at the moment. There, there are, there's multiple things going on and tensions are high, concerns are high. Uh, most of the civilian population has been evacuated from around here.